Okay. Okay. So then in 2004, you get traded to the Lakers. And of course, Kobe's on that team. Now, how was it like to be on that Lakers team in 2004? Um, I mean, for me, it's exciting because I get to be Kobe Bryant's sidekick at that time. Um, that's before the triangle offense. Um, I think we had Rui Tomjanovich. Um, but it wasn't successful. Um, not by Lakers standards. Not making the playoffs is like you might not want to go outside in LA mm. if you're a Laker. Um, <laughs> not over there, not over in the purple and gold. I might be with the other um, LA team is used to or accustomed to, or maybe even accept. But as a Laker, you know. Well, uh, Master P did an interview, and he said that you stopped him almost getting into a fight with Kobe Bryant. <laughs> what happened there? He said that to you? Not to me. He said it in an interview. Oh, you heard him say it? Yeah. Well... Well, and okay, so you know, you're practicing with the Lakers. People might just come pop up. You know what I'm saying? You might not notice them. You might, whatever. You might not say nothing. You might even catch eye contact with them. But you, you, you know, notice they're there, whatever. But I guess for whatever reason, you know, P came to our practice and what the, the aura. Or the energy or the timing of it, it didn't really being kind of just really wasn't feeling it. You know what I'm saying? So you gotta understand these are two, you know, alpha males, right? In their own right, what they do. And just it's just awkward. You feel me? Mm -hmm. So I'm from the street, right? So I can peep it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I'm just gonna like just just dead it. But it was it was awkward. It's awkward. Okay, so you got in the middle of them to actually stop them. Yeah, it wasn't like getting to the middle, but I'm just make I'm just gonna check both of their temperature, and make sure everything is cool. You feel me? Yep. I'm gonna use myself to make a queen's instinct. You feel what I'm saying? Right. Everything is cool, dandy. Come on, let's get back to practice. But it was just bad. It was just the energy was just off between them two. Got it. Okay, so like you mentioned, this was, I guess, only the fifth time in Lakers history that they didn't make the playoffs. See? I didn't, exactly. Even though you yourself had a good year, 15.2 points per game average, 10.2 uh, rebounds, but things aren't really gelling. Uh, now, Kobe, who's, you know, crazy competitive, was oh. he... Was he just going through it during that year? I mean, well, you got... <sighs> well, because he had just gotten Shaq traded for you to, you know, I mean, that you coming in was part of Shaq going uh, uh, going to Orlando, right? So there was like that whole and friction And if, if I'm not mistaken, did, a, my, did, a, did Miami make the finals that year? Let's look it up. But yeah, I mean, Kobe, yeah, he's going to, if he, you know, if you be, if you're around him, and y'all not winning. Um, nobody's producing. I think who got that? Who got that raft the most? I think my smush might have got that raft the most. Mm. 